Hello, Alex. I was here for my second upload for today. The part two to When I Girls X Listener X. Um, it's also Shinzo X Listener as well. Um, this was recommended by somebody, but I gotta keep the intro short because this one's a bit long. I don't want to have to separate it into parts. So, without further ado, I give you part two. After all the classes were over, the class 1A girls dragged you over to Mina's dorm to pick out an outfit for your supposedly date with Shinzo. You told them that over and over again that it was not a date, but they didn't seem to hear you by the way they acted. They put what felt like tons of makeup on your face and a pair of cute jeans, a shirt, and a pair of nice shoes on you as well. Now time for the accessories, squealed Mina. Wouldn't it look better if she had some earrings, said Momo. The rest of the girls nodded in agreement as they all rushed to get you a pair of earrings. You told them that you should really be going or you're going to be late. Hearing that, they all squealed and pushed you out of 1A dormitory, rushing you to Shinzo's dorm. Luckily, in all the chaos, she remembered to grab your bag and then proceeded to his door. Nervously, with every step that you took closer to his door, your heart began to race faster and faster and faster. Before you knew it, you were at his dorm door and hesitated before knocking. A million thoughts came flooding into your mind, and as if on cue, Shinzo opened the door. Hello there, listener. You can come in if you want to now, but if you don't mind me asking... You knew what he was about to ask. Why are you so dressed up? I I thought this was just studying. You explained to him that the girls from 1A had done this. He nodded his head. They can be such a handful, can't they? He nodded in agreement, walking into his dorm, which looked pretty plain. And then a strong scent of coffee came to your nose, which also lingered around his dorm. You are welcome. You are welcome to sit down, and I'll make you some coffee. You took a seat at his desk, which had a second chair pulled up since he was going to help you study. Shinzo's hands do a fresh cup of coffee. Here. Here you go, listener. If you don't mind getting your book set up out instead of staring at me, that would be great. You could feel your face get warmer at the fact that he noticed so quickly, so you got your books out of your bag. You laid them on his desk. His desk. So, what are you struggling with, listener? You open up your math notebook, telling him you were struggling with a few of the problems. Which problems are you struggling with? You pointed out the problems to him. Well, it's simple. If x minus 8 plus 45 equals 0, if you add 8, then it should be positive 8 on the other side. Then you've got to subtract 45. Well, that equals a negative 37, and that's what x is equal to. Do you understand this bit better now? You nodded in agreement that you had understand. You understood it just a little bit better now. Now, listener, what did you really come here for? He got closer to you, and you felt your face getting really hot cutie. You playfully hit him. He laughed. D- do you like me, little listener, as more than friends? You nod nervously, and the next thing you know, his lips are pressed against yours. I just happen to like you to listen. Uh, you kissed him as payback. He laughed. Okay, so that's the end for this video. Hope you liked the video. Subscribe. And please leave suggestions for me to do in the comments. Thank you. Bye.